Frankenberry, Booberry, and Count Chocula were three of the best cereals to ever come across our grocery store aisles. As children, we would beg our parents to get us some of these marshmallow-filled treats instead of the boring, old, healthier options, and when they actually did it, we were so thrilled. Even though kids loved the cereals, there were actually a couple of different controversies involving the General Mills classics competing against Tony the Tiger and Snap, Crackle, and Pop isn't the easiest task, but they managed to come up with some fun little creations for kids to fall in love with. But the parents weren't so happy about it. Cereal is supposed to be one of those things that is just easy to eat and you don't have to think about it much. However, a lot of people experienced some unusual issues after they ate Frankenberry cereal. The cereal came out in 1971. But by 1972 there was an influx of gastronomic difficulties being reported in kids. One boy was even hospitalized for four days with suspected rectal hemorrhaging, but eventually doctors realized that it was just the dye from his favorite cereal. The red dye that was used to make the cereal pink would turn their stool a bright pink or red which made people think it was blood. After realizing that the synthetic dye couldn't be broken down in the body. The company was forced to switch to a different type of dye. The company also got reports that their booberry flavor was affecting stools as well, except because it was turning green instead of red, parents weren't rushing their kids to a hospital. General Mills had to change their formulas, finding a way to get the colors they want without dyeing their customers' stool funny colors. Luckily they were able to switch it, and the dye wasn't found to have any lasting damage. Count Cocula cereal ran into their own controversy when they used actor Bela Legos's Dracula without permission. The actor was known for playing the iconic vampire in the 1931 movie, and while his family was not asked permission, that wasn't even the worst of it. When General Mills put his image on the box, their drawing seemed to have some issues with his medallion and it ended up looking like the Star of David. Several Jewish groups protested the thought that Dracula was Jewish, and while General Mills apologized for the mistake, they didn't recall any of the boxes. Thanks Tanya for help with this report. Thanks for watching. What did you think of this video? Let us know in the comments section below. You can also subscribe for more videos like these in your inbox. Now if you are seeking the latest trends in fashion, and electronics and gifts and more of the coolest things that you never knew existed at the best prices, please feel free to visit www.atthismall.com, once again that is www.atthismall.com. Share this video with your friends and family. Since you're watching, we have a small favor to ask. More people are viewing our videos more than ever but advertising revenues across the media are falling fast. And unlike many news organizations, we haven't put up a paywall, we want to keep our journalism as open as we can. So you can see why we need to ask for your help. Our videos and reports takes a lot of time, money and hard work to produce. Our investigative reporting uncovers unethical behavior and social injustice, that helps to hold governments, companies and individuals to account. Through this we can, together, create meaningful change in the world. We do it because we believe our perspective matters, because it might well be your perspective too. For as little as one dollar, you can support us, and it only takes a minute. Thank you. Like and share this video on Facebook and Twitter if you agree. Don't forget to support this channel by clicking on the donation link down below and subscribing so you never miss any of our trending reports. What do you think about this video? Scroll down to comment below. Now if you are seeking the truth or guidance or need a prayer request or studies, please visit followyeshva.com at www.follow. Y. E. S. H. U. A. Now.com. Please note that we have changed to a new YouTube channel, the link is in the description box below. Please subscribe to the new channel, as this one will no longer have new videos and reports posted to it anymore.